Hey everybody, Caregiver Dave. Five minutes of Dave's hammock wisdom. Dave Bassani, caregiverdave.com. Charlene, smile Charlene. She's exhausted. <laughs> it's always hard the last day in Hawaii because you got to get up early and didn't get much sleep. But today's wisdom is all good things must come to an end. So hopefully you did not squander your good time or your vacation or your your time of prosperity that you savored it and enjoyed it each and every day you appreciated every minute every second because one day the time will come where you have to sing that song the party's over it's time to call it a day and get back to work get back to the the grind although I don't like to think that I I'm ever in a grind because, you know, it depends on your attitude. Work should not be a grind. You should love your work. You should be passionate about your work. You should enjoy your work. And I'm excited to get back to work because there's a lot of good things that are happening. Um, there's I'm gonna start uh, working on my, on editing my documentary that they've been filming all this time and probably be working on it the rest of the year. Editing is the hardest part. Gonna be uh, releasing, re-releasing my, my best-selling book, It's My Life Too, with a new um, subtitle. Let me see if I can remember what it is. Um, Thrive. <laughs> it's My Life Too. Arrive and stay alive as a caregiver. There we go. And in April, hopefully, hopefully, fingers crossed, the release of my fourth book, Dave's Hammock Wisdom, 99 Lessons Learned Living Life. Going through the final editing phase of that as well. And then I'll be working on my new book. It has to do with all of my caregiver, my celebrity caregiver interviews. Transcribing, I think I've got over 100 of them, or a better number would be 99 or 101. So we'll be uh, transcribing those interviews with famous people. And many people you know, some people you may not know. Um, so as you can probably guess, I'm here at the airport. And the weather is beautiful. It was supposed to rain today and yesterday and the day before, but it didn't. It was sunny, so that just goes to show you don't get depressed about what the weatherman says because they don't know. They just don't know. And they're guessing, just like a lot of us are. You got to expect the best, plan for the worst. And that way you'll never be disappointed. So that's my advice. Savor each moment. Um, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye. Say goodbye. <laughs> She's so tired.